Good morning, vlog fam. It's super early, it's super cold, and I'm heading into work. Gonna get to, uh, get to work early today, so I can get home a little bit earlier. We have a small group tonight. Second time, we'll see how many people come. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so that's the plan. <coughs> Kids are going to swimming today, and uh, that's their first swimming class. Should be good. Should be a good day. The sun is coming out. All right, let's get this day started. See you at work. Meeting Tuesday. First meeting about to start. Got lost done already though, because it came in early. It's all good. Good morning from the van vlog fam. We are on our way to swimming lessons. So every Tuesday starting this week, we have swimming lessons early in the morning. <laughs> and it's with the homeschool group, so um, it's during the day, which is kind of nice. But today, we're going a little bit later because only Joel is going to do his lesson today. Because Mia and Ben are still coughing and like have a sore throat and stuff, so I was like, I don't think it's a good idea for them to go in the pool. So I don't, just Joel is I going. I don't have a sore throat. I just have a runny. You did have a sore throat all day yesterday, though. I know. But so just Joel is going to go in the pool today, and it's his very first swimming lesson. So And, oh, the battery is flashing that it's dead, so I better save that. So I just had a major, major epic fail mom moment. <laughs> we came for the wrong swimming time. Because last night, I guess, last minute they switched the age groups and it used to always be the older kids and the younger kids and they decided to switch it so it was going to be the younger kids and then the older kids so Joel missed his lesson so I got him like to the pool we raced there it's like a 40 minute drive for our swimming lessons and we got him all ready and then they were like oh his class is over so no, I hate when stuff like that happens I'm still, sorry Jolie they said he can still swim in the pool but we didn't well, they said he could go in with the older kids, but it's his first class and he doesn't know how to swim yet, so he can't go in with the older kids. But anyway, so back home. That was a waste of gas and an epic fail, but you know what? That happens sometimes. Ah, All right, we're back home now. The kids are doing some schoolwork and Joel is just playing and I'm doing some cleaning because we have a small group tonight at our house. But this afternoon, we are gonna do something fun. Um, and I need to change the battery in this camera still, but um, yeah, so still kind of frustrated that I missed Joel's class. I feel bad because I like worked it up for him and I was like, you're going to swimming and we were talking about it and whatever and then it didn't happen, but I guess it happened sometimes and he's been such a good sport about it. Like he hasn't complained once. He was like, okay, mommy. He was so good about it. So that made it easier. All done my meetings, I think. Time to get on with the rest of this day. So we're going to apple picking now. Uh-huh. You're recording me? We're gonna pick up Vanessa. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Gentle. Mommy, apple. Uh, empire. We got some empire apples. Yeah. A big juicy stamp. <laughs> Big juicy vampire. <laughs> you gonna feed him? We're back with the sheep. We got all our apples, and now we're just walking around having some fun. Is he gonna take it? <laughs> Random numbers. He's pushing against the fence. Hey, buddy. Oh, yeah. This guy's hand eater. His name is Hand Eater. Oh, Hand Eater. Maybe you should be careful of your hands then. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One time my hand was just on the wire and he tried eating it. It was funny. We named the poor sheep with a limp Olympia. Isn't that cute? Were you trying to feed it, Mia? Yeah, like, you know what's cold and I feel bad for her. <laughs> Heading back home. What a good day it was. So I was eating my lunch. And I hadn't eaten the whole, eaten the whole thing yet. And... I got a knock on the door. My office door. To say that someone ordered us lunch and we had 
so much food. Luckily, I didn't eat as, I didn't eat that much yet for lunch. I was just eating leftovers from the weekend. And uh, yeah, so Harvest Berry wanted to bless our staff for our 10th anniversary. They ordered us lunch from Big Bone Barbecue. So good. But I am so stuffed. So stuffed. Whew. It was, uh, it wasn't a super productive afternoon, to say the least. Oh, it's just so full. Anyhow, I'm on my way home now. And uh, we have small group tonight. So, check out these clouds. Very ominous, as Shelly would say. Weird. So, small group tonight. And, uh, yeah. I think, uh, looking forward to that. Hopefully there's uh, one more couple there tonight. That'd be good. See you at home. Quick stop at Freshco. By the ambulance. By the ambulance. Well, I, oh yeah, I did actually. Yep, I knew it. I heard it, and I'm like, oh, then I get pulled over. Yeah, there must be something big going on. Yeah, what I got, guys? What? All the way from Australia. Oh, oh, wow. Yeah. That's cool. Huh? Why does it have so many stamps? It makes a lot of stamps to get to Canada from Australia. Cool. Okay, about like five or six or seven weeks ago, we had one of our lovely viewers um, from all the way in Australia ask if they could send us some Australian candy. And of course we said yes. <laughs> and it finally arrived. So we're gonna open it and see what's inside. And we wanna give a huge shout out to Janae because this is who that is from and she watches our vlogs a lot, Janae Gilbert. And she follows us on Instagram and she's very nice and we appreciate her sending us this. So what do you guys say? Say thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's see if Mia, you pull out the first name. Ooh, chocolate. Ah. Wow. <laughs> so this would be something that we could get here but doesn't look the same. This chocolate doesn't look the same as ours. What else is in there? Thank you. Tim Tams! Tim Tam Slam! Christmas from Australia wants to brought these back and I've always wanted them since. So there you go. This is ooh, Carmelo Koala. Oh. <laughs> these look good. What is this? Oh my goodness. <laughs> <Get your bite. laughs> That's so cool. Oh, careful guys. They can't get enough. We have some little chocolate. Hold on, Joe. What? What is it? Eat it. That is called bubbly dairy milk. That looks good. Yeah. And crunchy. We have crunchy in Canada too, actually. We don't have this one though. It's called a picnic bar. Oh, a picnic bar. And what's this? These are called fans. I'm probably saying it wrong, but they're called fan tails. Fantails? Oh, no. fantails. Oh, yeah. Maybe. Give it to Mama. And there's a no. Oh. Okay. Hey okay, guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna read the letter of who sent this. Listen, Joel. It says, Dear Summer's Vlogs, my name is Janae Gilbert and I am from Australia. Wait, it says NSW Australia. What does that mean? Like a certain part. Like I don't know. I'm 13 years old and I'm in year seven, which means I guess grade seven. Anyway, I wanted to send you guys some Australian lollies and chocolates and Vegemite. You may <laughs> have heard of Vegemite. Most of the time when people taste test it, they put it on a spoon. What you have to do is get a piece of toast and spread box. some butter on it. And after that, smear a tiny bit of Vegemite on it. I know this from watching Donovan Jones. <laughs> <laughs> Most Ooh. people who try Vegemite don't like it, but I love it. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy the food. Love, Janae. And it says, P.S. Could you shout out my Instagram? Candy. Yep, we can. And it's um, underscore Janae Gilbert underscore is her Instagram. So. We'll put it right here. 
And she said, also, if you don't know how to pronounce my name, it's kind of like Janae, which I figured that's what it was. So we were pronouncing it like, right? Thank Sweet. you. <laughs> Thanks, that's Janae. So cool. This is our first, you're the first person who have who has ever sent us something, and we really appreciate it. So now we have some yummy stuff to try. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I want to smell it. What is it? This is what happened to the apples we picked today. We're making apple crisp for our small group tonight. Ooh, focus. Thanks for chopping the last few apples. Thanks for chopping all the rest. I didn't know you were doing it. <laughs> all right, it's all ready to go in. This is gonna smell so good. Small group is over. We added one couple tonight, so there were six of us. Still small, but still a group. <laughs> And Shelly made the apple crisp, which she didn't reveal to you. I can't believe it. I forgot. It is amazing. Oh. We ate half of it. Yeah, we ate half of it. There it is. What? Slow motion. <laughs> <laughs> it was very good. Thanks, hun. No problem. Blurry, hun. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> it was very good. The so, kids want it for breakfast. Oh, yeah. Kids want it for breakfast. I think that's a little weird, but anyway. Oh, Shelly's eating off the spoon again. <laughs> Always, every time, for everything. Always over the sink. Shush. Anyway. All right, the night is over. Small group went uh, a little late, maybe a bit late. Not too late. So I have small group tomorrow night, and I have another study on Thursday morning. I have lots of small groups this week. <laughs> um, but that's okay. So the night is over. I'm going to go pack it in and... What are you gonna do? Night night. Night night it? It's late. It's late. I'm gonna go see hopefully hopefully the children are in bed. I haven't seen them for They're in bed. an hour, two and a half half hours. So I haven't heard anything, so that's good. Thanks for watching everybody. We will see you tomorrow. Later. <laughs>